I'm Neil Anderson and I'm here with Dean Armada and we're going to talk about what is the best non CCNP certification to take after your CCNA. Alright, what if a student or a network engineer is already CCNA but he doesn't want to do CCNP? You know, these are traditional path. Yeah. Um, there is a new path. This is Cisco. One is DevNet and one is CyberOps. Yeah. And uh, I think Cisco is moving towards to more open source. Talk about Python, Docker, Kubernetes, Ansible, and also working towards cloud. What do you think about it? From a student's point of view, from a network engineer's point of view, like whether they should do it or not? Again, again, more certifications is good, and yes, the way that the industry is moving is towards a lot more automation now. They are, automation is covered to a degree in the standard CCNA and the CCNP yes. enterprise as well, but yeah, you're going to get more if you do these other new tracks. Also, as I was talking about earlier, security is very hot right now, so cyber ops is also a certification to get. Yeah. All right. So what if a student, uh, I don't like doing Cisco anymore, let's yeah. move uh, to non-Cisco certifications. Okay. What do you think are the best options out there? Let's take no, 10 years ago or 15 years ago, the most common route is CCNA, then CCNP. Yeah. Now, we have many options. Yeah. Okay, if they've just done the CCNA, again, I strongly advise them to do that CCNP enterprise. As I said, it's not really a lot more work to do it. But if they are going to do something different, yeah, there are lots of different options that they could do. What I would actually advise people to do, so what I would normally say, is have a look at the job boards in your particular location. And then you can just type names of certifications in there and you'll see how many results that you get back. So imagine that you're considering doing AWS certification, then go on to job board, whichever is the most popular one in your area, and type in AWS in there and see what jobs are associated with AWS. And that way, you can actually find out for yourself what is in most demand right now in your area. The kind of things to check are AWS is one, VMware would be another one. Lots of different options for it. All right. How about security? And there are tons of security, not tons, but multiple security paths. Yeah. Right? Before, when you talk about security, these are more VPNs and firewalls. Yeah. Now, security is broader. What do you think about it? Well, this is your area. Of oh, it's my area. So, yeah. so I have to answer my own you question. Ask you on what would. From a certification point of view, what do you think would be the best certification to get for security right now? All right. Um, if you are new to security, definitely security plus, like the CompTIA certifications. Okay. And then um, I would also go for NTEST plus. It's a good or it's a better strategy before going for OSCP. And the reason why I love, uh, I recommend SART Security Plus and NTEST plus because if you take CCNP security, your CompTIA security certifications will be renewed as well. Yeah. So that's why I recommend, especially for those who want to start with cybersecurity role. Uh, but I also want to highlight this. Web security or web application penetration testing is something that I would love to push. Um, you can start with F5 as the application delivery controller solution. It's a mix of many things, networking, Linux, um, web application security, and then you can move to web application firewall and combine it with web application penetration testing certifications. That is also a path that I highly recommend for people to take. Okay. How about CEH? CEH, uh, I would mm -hmm. prefer Security Plus and Pentest Plus. Yeah. There's a problem with CEH. Uh, first, Expires like three years, and there's no other certification that's widely recognized after it. So, right. most of the CAH I know, um, certified at Copacker, most of their CH expired. 
because you don't want to take the same certification after sure, a job again. Yeah, 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 same again, same certification after three years. At least in Confia, after the Security Plus and Pentest Plus, if you are certified as a CCNP security, that will be reviewed automatically.